hi guys welcome to my videos so guys today in this video i'm going to describe how you can apply for partner of a student work visa for new zealand before i proceed further i would like to clarify neither i'm an immigration consultant nor i'm a government body so if you take anything out of this video you do it at your own risk my intention is to just to show you how to navigate through a service whatever information and whatever entries you see in this uh, video may or may not apply to your case so take your decision as per your case not exactly what you see in this video so first of all what this visa is and for whom this is so basically if it is granted to you you are allowed to work but it is allowed to whom who has a partner who is uh, studying in new zealand towards a level 7 or 8 qualification on their long term skill shorter list or level 9 or 10 qualification okay and with this this is kind of open work uh, visa where you you don't need a job offer to apply and you get the uh, length is going to be the same as per your partner student visa you can join your partner in new zealand you can work in new zealand and you can study up to three months and this is open you can apply for it so in order to apply you click on apply now and then you go to realme account okay so first you need to create a login for yourself if you don't have uh, you need to create because I have so I'm going to enter and I'm going to log in. Alright guys so when you log in on the first page you get options which visa you want are going to apply. So there are various links. You will get a link for work visa. You will get a link for partner or child visa. For this particular category we will click on partner or child visa because this is like partner of a student. Right. So and, and then you get right to work. So we will uh, use that link. So using that link we have reached to this page and now here are you applying for a visa as a partner child of one of the following so student visa is a visa holder so i select yes and then we are gonna uh, answer do you have a master card so you need to answer as per your case okay don't see exactly what i am doing are you a stressing person no if i am why will i apply <laughs> start my application wait a few seconds yes so this is the first uh, section you need to uh, put your uh, password your details okay these are very simple details uh, whatever is applicable in your case that you need to do then uh, other name if applicable these two okay where uh, birth information travel document details this is uh, if applicable if you have other city and shape current partnership status if you have done this select yes if not no current address telephone email group app i select no whatever the applicable in your case and then we got to click on continue so i'm going to put some sample information here what is asking which one so i select this you need to enter as per your case and i'm going to click on continue no more questions so that's why i have some patience so this one we are applying partner link together in general okay now it is coming how does your partner say a visa stress allow them to support this visa application okay i select this one because we read in the criteria these two right how long you plan to stay in zealand total employment time you have already spent in new zealand i select uh, this one whatever the applicant gives supported i have sufficient for my sponsor financial supporting my stay okay provide details of relationship with your supporting partner are you currently living together as you said have you been living together for past then you need to provide details if you're i mean you can say that husband is uh, gone to new zealand and that's why you are not living together whatever is your case like it by this case by case if you are already in new zealand then yes if you are living in india and he's gonna go to new zealand then yes like that have you been limited to the for 12 or I select. Uh, you can say that the why I have entered in this combination. This is just a sample. You need to enter as per your case. You part of the for the same period of time. Yes. Are you close relatives? No. Oh, I I want to select no. You can click on it and uh, you can understand why I selected no. Oh, I think this will give me an error because I left this mandatory field okay next is supporting person details 
so supporting person is a person who says okay so in this case your husband who already has a student visa how is this person related to you? this person is my so his details so name date of birth title uh, or passport detail country information so I'm gonna put some sample okay now your health information be very careful I'm just putting no but you need to provide the information as per your case have you stayed lived and more or lived for more than three where have you visited or lived for more than three months within last five years so let's say this applicant has not gone out of India so only India but whatever is the case have you previously provided access service have you previously provided no when you applied for last visa I have not asked for medical information okay fine and I'm gonna click on uh, continue whatever is applicable in your case you need to do the not and now character requirements I'm gonna select no for all because this is a sample video but you need to read understand read this portion and then uh, you need to answer I'm gonna click on continue now this is about work history are you currently working I select no because I assume like she is a housewife but whatever is applicable in your case and I'm gonna click on continue do you have any contact in New Zealand so yes because like uh, her husband is there but this is a sample video just to navigate through this screen I'm selecting no but uh, because she is going she already has a contact right husband at least so but for the sample video I'm selecting no but you can understand right I, I explained already apply on me are you completely in the form of someone else no she is doing on her own so I know have you received immigration advice I select no whatever is applying in your case click on continue so now we have reached the upload section the passport style photograph of okay photograph relevant pages of passport identification if applicable not in English and translation sponsorship form I one to one zero two five evidence relationship this information you must provide she needs medical test either physician submitting okay they, did your physician supply your medical reference code if you select yes they may ask you to provide that <laughs> evidence your genuine stable uh, stable relationship evidence living with partner provide a timeline of your relationship okay and if you don't understand that you need help you can click on it it's gonna give you more information key dates in relation of any way okay photo page of your partner's passport or travel document complete form for partner supporting temporary entry application if you want to provide more documents you can click here and you can uh, provide them and after this upload documents you have declaration payment so the sample videos I'm not going in declaration and payment section but you have got the idea right here you can add additional documents what you got so thanks for watching this video guys please subscribe to the channel and again this is a sample video a lot of steps I skipped because I just wanted to show you the service but when you do the service actually for yourself you need to enter each and everything as per your case and not what you see here thanks for watching